Hello everyone, welcome to this video. This is a really quick unboxing, just to, it's a sort of a surprise boxing. I'm not I'm not quite sure what this is. It's either one of two things. One, it's my mod chip for my PS1 that my friend is gonna mod. And the second thing will either, sorry, the second thing will be uh, the mod chip for, or sorry, the it's called an E3 flasher, which uh, you can install to your PS3 to downgrade your PS3 to be able to jailbreak. Now, if you haven't seen my jailbreak tutorial on 3.55, I'll put the link in the description or annotation on the screen. Uh, so, yeah, it's one of those two things. I got a feeling it's the E3 flasher. So, yeah, that's, uh, I've already sort of opened the thing just to make the video easy, but I haven't looked inside. So, uh, yeah, I've put, taken the address off. And... Yes, it's the E3 flasher. Look at that. There it is. E3 Nor flasher. Now, obviously, if you don't understand what one of these are, search on YouTube or you know, Google. You'll definitely find out what it is. But it's just a device that allows you to downgrade uh, your your PS3 to 3.55 so you can jailbreak. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, let's see how to get in with this without breaking the box because I want to contain the box as best as I can I was glad that it, uh, that's this one because my mate actually at the moment said he's uh, can't jailbreak sorry he can't uh, put the mod chip in my uh, in my ps1 for, uh, you know the other my other unboxing that will come because the uh, currently his uh, um, what are they called? A soldering iron uh, broke, so he won't be able to install it for a while. But uh, at least I've got the the um, E3 flash, which is really nice. And uh, yeah, there it is. There's the. Uh, all right, I've got to carefully take this out. There's a little foam. I don't want to. Uh, God, how do I? Jesus Christ, I've got to be very careful with this because it's uh, there's a bit more bit of foam. Now this part here, which is uh, the part, the main part itself of the device, which you're going to want to keep um, very safe. This is a, which has all the switches that allows you to um, technically like do the dumping and stuff, the dump the files onto the computers. I, I, I can't really explain it too well because I don't know it that much. I just watch tutorials and learn how to do it. Uh, right, here's the I'm, actually, I'm not sure what that is. I think that's... Um, yeah, I'm not quite sure what this part is, but... Uh, put that to side. Now, this part here is one of the most important parts of it, which is the part that you connect to your PS3, uh, part to the motherboard itself. Um, it's literally a, a strip, so you've got to be very careful with this. You don't want to break it. Um, Trying to feed it through. Now, put the box aside. This half here uh, connects to the uh, the motherboard itself, and this this end is a bit um, temperamental. It's got to actually be um, pressured down with some stuff. People sort of uh, put come up with their own ideas and put a bit of tape on it or put a bit of foam uh, and then some tape to push it down a bit more and uh, then this end this end goes into the the E3 flasher itself so I will show you that now it's a bit uh, bit of a loose bit of connection there uh, wire right how do I stuck to the box yeah, now if you want to order one of these, no, most likely they will come from fo uh, like foreign places. Um, you've got to be careful out there because the, you could get some fake ones. Uh, but I can, you know, I made sure I was <laughs> getting a real one and uh, you know a good setter. Now there are a few ways of telling if your E three flashers um, fake. Now I'm trying to work out for myself. Yeah, there's a part on here. You won't be able to see it, but it's it's over here in this little corner bit here. There should be some. I think it's if it has numbers on it. Um, I always forget which way it is. It like uh, um, 
But there's a few ways here. There's certain things you can find out that if it's fake from this end. And then uh, I think it's something about the back as well. But I'm not too sure on that one. But anyway, uh, yeah. The So what you do is connect. Um, so yeah, um, this end here connects to it like this. So let me do that now without breaking it. <laughs> Got to be very careful with it. But there we are, I think that's on. So now this uh, slot, this end sort of slots into, they come with it, it's very nice, it comes with, it's like the little pack and set for it. Goes with this, which is really nice. That it slots into there like a, the hard drive bay that you get with your PS3s. Um, oh, it's, it's quite good there. Put a bit of nice protection bottom bit on there. I don't know if that's meant to stay on there or not. I'm going to keep it on there just in case. And then... It's a bit rattly, but I think they're meant to be like that. This end... Ooh, here... Connects to the E3 flasher. Like... Onto that... That bit there in the corner. So... Let me try and do that. It should just clip in there. Sorry if it's not on shot, I'm just trying to work it out for myself. There we go. You might have heard that click. And uh, yeah, it just clips in there. This end goes into the onto the motherboard. This, like I said, this is the more temperamental end that obviously you've got to sort of apply pressure for it. But you'll you'll see that in other you know in people's videos. Now I might make a like installation video on one of these uh, one day. I don't think I'll be doing it for quite a while because I want to learn it myself and you know succeed and hopefully you know uh, successfully mod. Sorry, or downgrade to be able to mod uh, my PS3 Slim because uh, currently I've got to the left of me now. I've got my modded uh, 60 gig, which is or well, jailbroken. Uh, yeah, so that's about it really. That's the unboxing of the E3 Flasher. Uh, sorry, it was probably a bit longer than I you know, thought, but I just thought I'd explain it as best as I can. And uh, yeah, this, like I said, I'm not too 100% sure what this uh, part is yet. I will probably find out. I'm not sure if I'm actually going to do anything with it. But yeah, um, if I find out, I might put an annotation just to sort of yeah or in the description but yeah that's about it that's been the unboxing of the e3 flasher i do hope you uh enjoyed this video uh, if you did please smack the like button and as always please comment like and subscribe and uh i'll see you